say too, God, you walked in today, and I just saw what you were wearing. You walked in, and I was like, and then you walked out today, like in this, and I was like, oh my gosh, you have you always been into fashion? Yes. Is it just natural for you? Well, no. Speaking of the church, you know, the black church is a fashion show. Yeah. And I'm first generation post civil rights movement, mm -hmm. so you know, I was taught that the first impression. Uh, is what you look like, so you must dress up. I came from the, you dress up in suits. I wore a suit to school. I wore a jacket and a tie to public high school. Yeah. You know, dress for the job you want, not the one you have, was what my great Amen. aunt Dorothy told me. Yeah. So, you know, there were lots of combinations of that, and then I've been able to now use uh, my fashion sense as activism. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. Make a political statement as well. Yeah. Yeah. And then you, I feel like every time I see you, like on a red carpet, like literally you are a walking fashion, but also slash political statement. There's yes. always something happening that, that's deeper. And it's I always love that. dual. Yeah. yeah. And that's on purpose? It's always on purpose. Yeah. Everything I do is intentional. Okay. I love Everything it. Everything I do is on purpose. Yeah. You know, and, and because I've lived mm. long enough, I've been in this business for 35 years, I've made the decision that. What I wanted to do as an artist mm -hmm. was to use my art to heal. Oh, yeah, of course. My art, art is healing. Because it's so healing for us. It's yeah, healing, so you share and that. I want to share that. Mm -hmm.